Hello everyone, it's the Scarlet Wolf here, and today it's going to be a different video. This is going to be a behind the scenes video of some of the changes I've been making to Lovely World, and you can see some of them behind me. Uh, I've been making these changes to the fan made map, so I'm not sure if I'll just stick with using this map for the series, or if I'll just transfer the changes over to the official one. I still haven't decided that, but the series will definitely be starting after the map releases. Unless it's delayed for some reason, then yeah, but we'll see. So first change, I updated the bedroom, as you can see, and I added this little food dispenser robot so if you watch my series grow grove you know i usually have bob the food dispenser but this is betty so she's gonna be the food dispenser for this series she'll be giving me my breakfast every morning and then i got a poster here and then i change this area so, more like my style. Um, I updated the storage room. I changed the crafting room. So, it's not a crafting room anymore. I don't know what I'm going to make it. But for right now, it's just like little like green room covered porch area. Covered porch area. Uh, anyways, so, um, go through here, change it to Scarlet's home, oh, and then I change this area, once again, match my style, uh, ignore the floating items, that was just where I dumped my inventory out earlier, and I changed the doghouse a bit, so, I don't currently have any dogs, so there's no, like, little doggy mats down yet, but I did change it slightly, and then uh, there. Uh, if we go up here, you'll see. I cleared out all, well, except apart from the tree farm, I cleared out the rest of the farms because there wasn't really much use for them anymore, so I figured just get rid of them and build something else here. Also, I want to, I'm thinking of trying to find a use for the chicken coop. I almost want to turn it into a restaurant, which might sound weird, but I just really, it feels like that's what I want to turn it into. Um, so yeah, and then over down this way, I have this, which is the community courtyard, which is going to be my version of the love garden. Uh, so for like fan art or favorite co featured comments, anything like that. And go back in a circle. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, I forgot. So, uh, I've been, I updated this area. I also updated this area, but if we can find it down this way and his house is so confusing and uh, no the stairs go down to the library i updated the library which i think is looks pretty good i might add a little bit more lighting but so i think it's pretty good i updated most of this in like all in like one or two hours, I think, like, <laughs> I spent, I think, like, one or two hours changing all this. Apart from this, this was done a couple days ago. Uh, same with the community courtyard. And if you guys have any suggestions or feedback for updates, like, changes or anything, let me know in the comments. I'm trying to figure out why it seems like no one's commenting on my videos. Like, I don't get it, but... So, I changed the outfit store slightly, so... Instead of just being plain stone, it's uh, andesite and stone bricks. 
Yeah, and I a site called the Trims Clothing Store, like Armor Trims. And then I've been updating the Pig a Pet Pet Shop, which is now the Zebra Pet Shop and Animal Shelter. And sh I don't know. I feel like I'm going to get mixed feedback with changing the names, but the original names just didn't fit the style I'm going for for in changing these so also another thing to note is some of them will change because my character just finds them destroyed she doesn't know what they were originally called so she just comes up with whatever name she can think of and then I removed the water in this uh, pretty kitty day spa just because since this is a swamp biome, it really did not look good. Like, I don't know how I'm gonna change it, but it just didn't look good. Like, it looked all murky and just bleh. I the fire station and the fire truck slightly and made most of it, most of it, made most of it out of concrete instead of wood because uh, I don't think it's very smart to have a wool fire truck. <laughs> nothing against, like, not trying to be rude, nothing against Stampy, just, uh, you know, well, I get when he made it, there was no concrete, and that's why most of these buildings are made out of wool. But, yeah. And then, I'm really... I really want to update the Hotel of Dreams. I just, I'm not sure how. Because I want to create the, I want to keep the original feel of it, but so much of it I don't like. <laughs> like, I want to keep the nostalgic parts, but, I want to keep the nostalgic parts, but most of it I just don't like. Like, when I was little, it was so amazing, but now it's just like, ugh. <laughs> Once again, nothing against him, but, uh, it's all wool, <laughs> and, I mean, I'm, I was actually surprised this elevator still works, which I thought it didn't, because I thought it was one of the boat ones, but it's not, but yeah, like, once again, if you guys have any, suge any suggestions for the Hotel of Dreams, being revamped, I would really appreciate it because I'd love to make it better but still keep the original feel of it. Oh, and uh, you see worrying about this, I was trying to figure out how to, uh, I wanted to add a fountain to the glowstone at the top, but I was trying to build like a pond around it. So, the next change I made was I updated the park a little bit. I added some more, like, used some bone meal, added some grass, some more flowers, some trees, and then I added this special tree that has the names of every dog that has passed away in this Minecraft world. And this sign says, for every loved one lost, there is another angel waiting for you. So this has every dog and like I double check I went back and watched the videos and double checked to make sure I got them all. I think I might have missed one or two, but I'm 99.9% sure I got them all. And then I changed the fun land to I changed the name of the fun land to the Eclipse Theme Park. I also changed the border once again to match my style. Uh, I think I'm gonna probably change this tunnel because it looks good with shaders, but unfortunately I can't get shaders and it does not look good without them. Like it just really doesn't. But I added steps and like a little pathway here to get into the fun land. Cause I also, I couldn't get the nether portal to work on here, so I just added stairs instead. 
So, anyway, I think that's every change I've made. I didn't think there was any other ones. But yeah, definitely leave some comments below if you have any suggestions or feedback. Oh, I added some Googly's Hill. I put all Googly's welcome. Uh, yep. And then, um, yeah, I think that's it. Oh, well, I did also make a slight change. So, in the museum, I added this, which is hit the TARDIS redemption and final goodbye, which is basically the letter he left at his castle. Uh, yep, and I think that's it. So, uh, thank you all for watching, and I will see you all later. Bye!